Hey guys, today we're going to do an edgy color block design inspired by Young, Wild, and Polished. I'm going to start by painting one coat of HK Girl Top Coat on my nails and waiting 10 minutes for it to dry. I do this before any tape design. Then I'm going to go in with Super Skinny Nail Vinyls from nailvinyls.com and I'm just going to block off some areas making some angles so that you'll really get the color block effect. You can place them wherever you would like. I like to use nail vinyls instead of just regular striping tape because it's pre-cut and it just makes the whole process a little bit faster. And then I'm going to fill in the shapes with a dotting tool. I like to use a dotting tool instead of the polish brush just because I feel like it's a little bit easier to make sure that you don't get colors in a place that you don't want them and it's a little bit easier to get into those little corners and angles. And I'm just using three separate dotting tools here because I didn't really want to worry about cleaning off my colors and mixing them. So I just switched to different dotting tools and I'm using ones from whatsupnails.com. The colors that I used will be listed in the description box below. So I'm just dabbing those right into the different squares and shapes. Sorry that my hand is blocking some of it. Sometimes it's hard to film at certain angles. And then I'm just going to go in and finish with black just to give, make it a little bit edgier. I feel like I've been doing a lot of dainty things lately. And I just wanted to give it a little bit more edge. And then you want to make sure that you remove those nail vinyls immediately. Do not wait for the polish to dry. If you wait for the polish to dry, you'll notice that it'll get stringy and you won't get a clean and crisp line. So I like to use tweezers so that I don't get all clumsy and bump it with my nail. And then I'm just going to go in with a concealer brush and pure acetone and clean up any little spot that I got polish on my finger, cuticle, or anywhere I didn't want it. Wait a few minutes for everything to dry, and then you're going to add top coat. As always, I'm using HK Girl by Glisten and Glow. Make sure to wrap your tips for prolonged wear. If you recreate this look, please tag Nailstorming Inspired on Instagram so I can see.